Hello, my name is Ryan Tabor and I'm a Solutions Consultant with Beyond 20. Today I'm going to be going over cloning the specifics object to a new incident. So cloning incidents is out-of-box functionality in Sharwell 963. This one step copies select fields from the original incident object to a new one, but does not carry over any of the specifics information. Instead, it creates a blank specifics object based on the classification of the ticket. One of the common business object actions is to transfer related business objects. Add this action to the one step and select original business object from the from business object side and choose the relationship which will be incident owns specifics. Within transfer to, make sure that the business object from action create incident is selected and choose the relationship incident owns specifics. If I run this as is, I will probably get an error. The reason is that the specifics relationship is set up as a one-to-one -one relationship against incident. This relationship, by default, is populated by auto-creating a specifics object on the classification, which is from this create incident action. To successfully copy the specifics object from our original object, we will need to delete this auto-created specifics object. The fast way to do this is to use a step through children action choosing specifics as the child business object. Drilling into this, we will add a delete business object action. Save. Now, when running this one step, we can see that the specifics object is recreated in the new business object. And that is how you clone a specifics object in a new incident. Hopefully you have found this interesting, and we will see you next time.